to the sea and not any crown. Yo, 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 the sea's forever. Yo, 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 the wings forever. Long after I met Davy Jones, still I'm not but skull and bones. Yo, Rosa Pirate, you're telling me you don't like sea shanty music, man? Raise the sails and drink with me. Here's to us. Live long and long live piracy. Bring around into the wide of treasures to be found. A pirate's life and nothing else to the ship she's going down. Yo, ho, yo, ho, the sea's forever. How is everybody doing on this fan fucking tastic Thursday chat? Oh, why is my alert box going off? It's not even on. What the fuck? How is everybody doing on this fantastic Thursday chat? I just ate Chick fil A. I just ate Chick fil A. I feel like I'm going to throw up. Not because the Chick fil A was bad, but I ate too much. Normally, I start streaming, I'm pretty hungry, and then I'm starving at the end. Um,. You know when you eat so much that you, like, your stomach is, like, you feel your stomach pressing on, like, your organs? Or it's just, like, I'm, like, struggling to not, hold up. Like, I'm, like, bloated. <laughs> like, I'm, I swear to God, I'm not pushing it out. Like, it's just, it's just sitting there. I mean, if it's, like, <laughs> it, like, hurts. Ah. Uh... Yeah, it looks like I'm pregnant. Hades for the five gifted. Thank you for the fucking five gifted subs. Thank you for the sub. Thank you for the five gifted. It's Malibu for the fucking 19 month sub, 23 month total. Ghost Jojo Tello, iGens, Evil and Filthy for the fucking sub. Chat, what are we doing today? Well, we have many things in store. Starting off, we're actually in just chatting right now because we're going to be casting our votes for the streamer awards that are, I believe, I don't even know when they are. Hold up. February 17th. So they're in, uh, you know, like three weeks. So we're going to be casting our votes for the streamer awards. And um, I probably actually won't be watching them, but we're going to be casting our votes for them uh, today. Then... We're actually going to uh, transition into a bit of a random game day for a little bit. Uh, also, what is this shit on my nose? Chat, what is that? Also, people, the blackheads. Didn't you already do that? No, we did the nominations. Now the actual things are in. Chat, what is that? What is that on my face? It's a scratch. It looks, I don't know if it's a pimple. It's red. Anyways, um, I don't know. It might be acne. Uh, chat, listen. After that, we're going to be transitioning into a little bit of a random game day for a little bit. We're going to be playing a game called Suck Up uh, off rip, right? That's the first game we're going to be playing after we do our streamer award votes. If you don't know what that is, I just found out what it was yesterday. It's apparently an AI-based game. Where you need to moisturize. Shut your bitch ass up. We're not playing Booze Masters today, Chad. No. Uh, we're going to be playing Suck Up. And basically the premise of the game is that you're a vampire. And you have to uh, kill people. But the only way that you can kill people is if you convince them to go into your house. Or to go into their house. And it's an AI that you have to talk to. So every house you go to, I have to talk into my mic. And convince them to let me in their house. And then I kill them. Uh, so it's actually like a very unique game. Uh, using like new AI shit. So it'll be uh, you know pretty fun. Uh, so the responses are always different. Uh, then we might play uh, the Lancaster Leak O'Brien State Park. Which is supposed to be like an analog horror-esque short game. Uh, and maybe the Trolley Problem. 
uh, as well as maybe Perfect Vermin or Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator. I don't know for sure. Then, uh, at around 6.30 EST, in around two hours, we're going to be hopping on call with uh, myself, Zussi, Nolan, Sneak Snag, Zafo, and Handsome Fella. And us six are going to be running Lethal Company with 85 mods. Uh, most of them are, like, uh, like, better world-esque shit where it's not really changing that much. Uh, but apparently it's supposed to be, uh, <laughs> a lot of mods. And we'll see, uh, we'll see how it goes. Uh, Cloak made it. Uh, he made the mod pack. Is Juan gonna be there? <laughs> no, I don't know if Juan's gonna be there. Oh, Brooke's here. Do you want to say hi to chat? Wow, early stream appearance from Brooke. Haven't even really gotten into it. Still in the intro. She's here. Say, why are you, why are you doing, like, a, like, a pageant award winner wave? Yo, what's this on my nose? Huh? The mole I had removed is what she said. On no. Wow, that's so fucked on up. Side, that's so fucked dot. up. That wasn't even what I was asking about. Chad, I used to have a mole on my nose that I had to you get pointed, fucking you cut off. Right here. No, I you pointed at point my at nose, that. and then you bring up the mole Maybe. that I had to have removed. Did you point at that? You pointed on this Yeah, side. no, I was... You pointed on the wrong Okay, side now right? the dog's here, too. Oh, this gosh. Red dot? Yeah, the red dot on my nose. Maybe a pimple? You yeah, all right, can you stop touching my face? Wow, Brooke, that's so fucked up. I knew it was a mole. No, that's not what's on my face right now. I used to have a mole on my nose. I have some makeup. Dead cupcake for the sub carbon for the sub king for the 750 bits. How much would I have to donate to get you to say happy birthday, Brendan? I could say happy birthday, Brendan, right now. You don't need a dono. Happy birthday, you... Brendan! Okay. Uh, Kaden and Kem for the sub. Uh, Seb squared for the five gifteds. Dumb in the chat for that shit. Thank uh, Squared, if you got a sub, thank you for the fucking five gifteds. Z-Van and Mark for the sub, Mountain for the sub, Icy for the sub, Dark for the three, get a low temper, Fade, you mean taper. Final for the sub, William for the five. Uh, love your content, thank you. Uh, Titan, Greasy, April, Blaze, Hades for the fucking subs. All right. Yeah, everybody's saying, aw, Daisy. Yo, you shouldn't have shown Daisy. They gotta pay for Bart Box to see Daisy. You just, gave them, you just gave them a free Daisy showcase that's a little fucked up. What are you, what are you, lip syncing or something? B bird for the three. I have the flu uh, and lost 18 pounds. Holy shit. You lost 18 pounds with the flu? Your Walking Dead streams kept me alive. I finished the whole series in three days. Did my dog lick me? I love you, Joe Bar for the three. It's me again. I was the 13-year-old that friend to kill himself to at 12. What? I was the 13-year-old that I'm assuming you're saying you had a friend kill themselves. Wanted to say thank you again for helping me being the best streamer ever. Tell Brooke that she is so lucky. Your YouTube videos help me uh, get out of depression and almost killing myself. You're so inspiring. I look up to you. I also have a deviated septum. Can you say thank you, Berkeys and he Sam? I feel like that last word you probably spelled wrong, but thank you for the 300 biddies and Grizzly for the sub. And I mean, I'm glad I could help you with uh, your depression and, and dealing with the loss of your friend. Uh, rip in the chat for your friend. Suicide is never the answer. Uh, and can you stop touching my back? All right, I need to actually get into like my my games today. Can you? Yeah, I have a deviated something. Can you? Can you like? Yeah, I don't want to be rude or anything. You know, I love you, but uh, yeah, I gotta. You know, I gotta kind of entertain my chat here when you're just standing behind me awkwardly. All right, love you. Take the dog, please. Daisy, go. Daisy. Oh God. Oh God. No, you're gonna make her bark. Oh God, she's starting to growl. Oh fuck. Can you close the door? I'm kicking her out. I'm put. I'm hold up. All right. I love you, Jamar, for the three. I also lost a friend uh, to cancer, and it was me who tried to kill myself at twelve. Oh, I was a thirteen-year-old that friend to kill himself. I, th I, you, you spelled, you put friend, but I'm assuming you meant tried. Squared for the five, a little mock for the sub, king for the thousand. But he's, th uh, thank you for saying happy birthday. No problem. Chat. Um, are we ready to get into the fucking little, uh, streamer awards elections here, and then we're gonna fucking, or nominate, not even nominations, votes. We nominated, we nominated before, but now we'll have an option of the four people that could actually win. Uh, and then we'll get into the fucking games today. Bread for the sub, uh, Spartan for the three. Love your philosophy streams. I was thinking about doing it, uh, for a level, which is basically AP examination in the US. Do you think it'd be worth doing? And if so, what could you do with it? I have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. 
I was thinking of doing it for a level, which is basically AP examinations in the U.S. Uh, what do you uh, What do you mean? What can you do with it? You're gonna You're gonna take an AP test in philosophy for high school? I didn't even know that was a thing. Bread for the sub Hades for the thousand buddies. Me and my girlfriend of over a year broke up last night. And I want to know. I want you to know you're such an inspiration. And I appreciate all that you do for me and the rest of your audience. Uh, well being and moods. We all love you. Thank you. Next for the three. All right, chat. Let's lock in here, and I'm sorry that you and your girlfriend broke up, but I mean, I'm glad I could cheer you up in any way that I can, but chat, lock in here. We'll play a little vibey music as we, uh, as we cast our votes. Off rip! Best creative art streamer of this year, chat. I don't know any of these fucking people. Do you know any of them? Hit a blinker? No, I'm not doing push-ups either right now. Refund that shit. We gotta get through content today, chat. We got a lot of content we gotta get through. We got a lot of games we gotta play, and then we gotta hit up Lethal Company. So we're not fucking stalling in any way possible. Refund that shit. I don't know any of these people. We're going to fucking skip that bitch. Best MMORPG streamer. Streamer who has the most entertaining MMORPG content while playing games like World of Warcraft, New World, Final Fantasy. I like Asmund Gold the most, but I don't watch World of Warcraft, New World, or Final Fantasy or RuneScape. So, I mean, I don't really know who's the best streamer in that realm. But I know that if I was to pick which streamer I would want to watch out of all these guys, it would probably be Asmund or Soda. The only person I don't know is Maximum. I know who Asfend is, though. I'm going to go Asmund. Streamer that creates the best content while playing strategy games like Team Fortress, their Team Fight Tactics, StarCraft, Hearthstone, League of Legends. How is Tyler1 not on this list? Isn't he, like, the fucking main League of Legends streamer in, like, the entirety of Twitch.tv? I don't understand how he didn't make it. Toast? Since when does Toast play League? Oh, wait, no, there's other games. <laughs> Hold up, there's other games. I just keep... I, I, I'm sitting here thinking that League is the only one that people are, are, are getting fucking voted for. I only know BoxBox and uh, Toast, so I'll vote Toast. Best chess streamer. Brought to you by chess.com. Best streamer to watch for chess content. How the fuck did Tyler1 get on the chess streamer list? Top four? Top four chess streamer when he's a fucking league player? <laughs> like, how did that even happen? Gotham? I, I, I would probably have to... I know Tyler played chess for a bit. But, like, why did people vote for him for, for chess content? I'm pretty sure he got really good, though. He got, like, really high up. I'll put Gotham. Is it messed up? No, he did stream chess for a while. Uh, best software and game development streamer. I don't know who... I only know Code Miko and Doug Doug. I didn't even know Doug Doug does game development, but I'm going to put Doug Doug. Best fighting game streamer. Streamer who creates the best fighting games content, playing games like Street Fighter VI, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, uh, and Melee, Mortal Kombat, and Tekken 7. Sajam, Hungrybox, Etoyalese, and Maximilian Dude. I only know who Hungrybox is. I only know who Hungrybox is. These, that's the issue with a lot of this stuff is like, do you guys know who all these people are? You kind of got to be in that realm. I think as we get to like streamer of the year type nominations where it's like best fighting game streamer, or not fighting game, but best like shooting game streamer, we're going to all know who they, those people are, but... Best speedrun streamer? No way fucking Squeaks got on this list. Virtual Distortion and Liam and Squeaks. I'll put Squeaks in there. Hidden Gem. This award serves to highlight an amazing streamer with less than 100 average viewers during 2023. Can I... Okay, I love that they do this, but can I bring up a genuine issue here? People are going to randomly vote for who they like. So whoever wins out of this list isn't actually necessarily the best streamer because no one, like, if they have less than 100 viewers, there's going to be 80,000 fucking, 150,000 people fucking voting this out. Like, a million people voting on this. No one knows who, I mean, the majority of the people don't know who Sean and a Black is, uh, Lename a Gappy and Everything Now show. Nolan for the fucking five gifted. Thank you for the five gifted subs. Thank you for the sub. Thank you for the five gifted. Boo Baker for the sub please for the three. Uh, been watching for a while. You helped me through difficult times when I was depressed and suicide. All your streams always made my day. I wanted to say suicide is never the answer. Life has highs and lows, but know that you uh, matter. No, know that you matter, and there are people who love you. W message. Sorry, I fucking botched that for a second there. 
Toenail for the sub, Arch for the five or for the four. How many bets for you to play Poppy Playtime three on Tuesday? Not gonna play it on Tuesday. We'll play it on Wednesday. You smell bad for the three. You're the best. Love your streams. You help me every day, and I would like to donate for the first time after watching for two years. Dub. Jaden for the sub, Lil Muck for the three. Before I saw your notification, was already rewatching the Red Dead Two episode three. Why are you watching my Red Dead Two vod from fucking two years ago? Like I understand when people say, "Oh, I was watching your Walking Dead playthrough." You're watching me play Red Dead from fucking two years ago, and I didn't even finish the game. That's like that's like four years from now, somebody telling me they're watching me play Subnautica, and I'd be like, dude, I didn't even fucking finish it. Oz for the three. Read my message about the hotline game. Uh, be Bach for the three. Can I have your advice? I uh, The only thing I enjoy now is cutting my wrists, and I don't know what to do. My life is the biggest mess ever right now. I feel depressed lately, and I've been starting to consider suicide because everybody leaves me, and I get way too attached way too fast because everybody always leaves anyway. Uh, that is a self-destructive uh, mindset. Uh, if, you are, if you constantly go into friendships, relationships, and conversations assuming that everyone will leave you, then everyone will leave you. Because you're going to go into that vibe saying, wow, this isn't going to work out, right? Like, if every relationship you ever got in was, it, like, say you every person you ever started dating, you just said to yourself every day, they're going to break up with me. This isn't going to work. I'm not good enough. It's, it's not going to work, right? Like, obviously, some relationships are going to end. Some friendships are going to end. That's life, right? Especially if you're in high school. The people you know in high school, you're not going to be friends with in fucking 10 years, likely. I mean, a lot of the people you might be, but the majority of the people that you know in your fucking teen years, you're never going to fucking know when you're 30, right? So, I mean, my, what I would say is, number one, it's life. Don't really beat yourself up about it. Number two, just try and be more positive in the relationships that you go into. Number three, for depression, and you're saying you're, you're cutting yourself, number one, don't do that. Number two, reach out to somebody that could possibly help you, whether it be a friend, family member, psychiatrist, therapist. And even if they can't, they can direct you to somebody that can. I can't help you in that realm because I'm not a fucking therapist or a psychiatrist, but I can tell you that there are people that can help you. Aiden for the five, or for the sub. I love you, Jovar, for the three. Should I go into honors math or enrich geometry? Up to you. Next for the three, Hades for the thousand biddies. Uh, and then somebody wanted me to read their message about uh, home safety hotline. Future? Future thing here, though, if you're going to send a bit message and you want me to read a past message, you could just send it uh, in the bit message. Uh, you don't have any messages about home safety hotline uh, at all, unless you're talking about other days in which I'm not going to scroll up that many chats. Just type it in chat now. A Ava and Frey for the sub Cyclops of the three. Quit vaping after two years. Uh, OD Alley chain vaping. I'm going to play this one out on TTS because I have no idea what you're saying. Please type out grammatically correct sentences. I recently quit vaping after two years OD daily chain vaping and I couldn't be more proud of myself and I've noticed I feel a lot better so W. What do you mean? I, okay, I'm assuming you're saying you just quit vaping and you feel better. But after two years OD alley chain vaping, what does that mean? Quit vaping after two years, OD Ali chain vaping, and I couldn't be more proud of myself. Well, I'm glad that you quit, number one. Number two, I'm sorry if I'm missing part of the message because I don't know what you were trying to say there. It goes for the fucking, uh, oh, of daily chain smoking. Of, uh, you put o OD Ali, of daily chain smoking. Okay, I'm stupid. I should have read that. I should have been able to fucking, uh, figure out what the fuck you meant. But thank you for the fucking, uh, three, and I'm glad that you quit vaping, dude. All right. Next. On, on to the next tier, chat. Hidden gem. This serves to highlight an amazing... Tr oh. Hey, should I even vote on this one? I feel like it's fucked up if I put somebody, because I don't know any of these streamers. I'm going to skip. Be because, like, I don't know them, and I don't want to fucking put someone... A lot of people are saying Gappy. Okay, fine. Best Battle Royale streamer. Best streamer to watch play Battle Royale games like Fortnite, Apex, PUBG, Call of Duty, and Warzone. No one watches anyone play Warzone. Who the fuck? Why is that even on the list? Chat, when was the last time y'all watched a Warzone streamer? Asian Jeff. 100%. 100% of the time. Any, There is no world where I don't vote Asian Jeff in this fucking, in this lineup of people. I have no idea who the fuck Nicewig is. 
So I'm definitely not voting them. Cypher, sorry, man. Saw that Old Spice commercial. You let me down. You could have done better there. You could have had more creative input. Probably got a bag, though. So, I mean, at the end of the day, they probably just told you to say your lines and you got fucking $100,000. So, you know, I'm not really going to judge there. But it's Timmy, also fire, but Asian Jeff's more entertaining. Sorry. Best FPS streamer. Most enjoyable streamer to watch play first-person shooters like Overwatch 2. Nobody watches that. Uh, Call of Duty, Valorant, Halo. Actually, the pro scene's pretty fire on Overwatch. Call of Duty, Valorant, Halo, and Counter-Strike. Tarek, Super TF, Tens, and SOMC. I want to go. I want to go tens, just because my my heart still lives. My heart still lives with uh, you know the the cracked Valorant players. So I gotta go tens. Rising Star Wars goes to a streamer who's still on the rise and averaged under a ha uh, uh, out <laughs> oh my god I can't read, averaged under a thousand viewers last year but has the potential to be much more. not even not even a competition i have no idea who these other people are but it's not even a competition a handsome fellow we're literally playing with him later today best role play streamer streamer the best role play content like gta 5 role play rust vr chat arc and dungeons and dragons agent phantom lord kibun or omi agent i know a lot of people are going to say phantom and I think that's also a good choice but i really find agent very entertaining so I'm going to go agent on that. Best Minecraft streamer. Hmm. Kind of weird I'm not on this list. Hmm. Kind of weird. Kind of weird I'm not on any of these things, you know? Stream game of the year, shared channel, content org, stream series, streamed event. God, it's like, it's like you would assume that like maybe best just chatting streamer. Like, you, you know, like Will Neff's on this. You know, I feel like I could be on the, on this, but you know, it's all right. No, it's fine. You know, I, nobody voted for me. It's okay. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Uh, anyways, best Minecraft streamer, most enjoyable streamer to watch for Minecraft content. Probably gonna go um, skip on this one. Uh, best IRL streamer, streamer that creates the best IRL content, such as vlogging, traveling, and visiting places. Papsan, Ginny, Extra, Emily, and Rob. Don't know them. Don't know any of them. Stream game of the year. The best game to watch on stream during the past year because it was entertaining. Who the fuck would vote Baldur's Gate 3? You're going to be on crack to vote Baldur's Gate 3 here. Lethal Company, literally playing it later. Only Up. Only Up was a good game to watch. But it was like, how long was Only Up popular? A week? Maybe a month. When was that even popular? Like July or August? I feel like that was good, but GTA 5, no. Dude, the fact that GTA 5 is even in contention for game of the year just kind of pisses me off. Uh, I, I'm going to ramble about this for more than I need to, but this fucking game came out 11 years ago, and it is literally on the 2023 game of the year. Uh, for the love of God, can people stop playing GTA 5 until GTA 6 comes out? Like, the fact that if you go on Twitch, GTA 5 is still in the top categories on Twitch astonishes me. Uh, I, I just want GTA 6 to release, and I honestly blame... I know that, that the devs at Rockstar are slow, and they really want to make a good game. But I genuinely believe that if GTA 5 roleplay didn't exist, GTA 6 would have been out for two years. Because it only motivated Rockstar to further push back the development of GTA 6 in my mind. And just keep updating GTA 5. Which is an 11 year old game. I might I might as well say again. I was 12. Uh, or actually I was 11 when that game came out. Uh, let me just say that. So uh, can we please uh, stop playing GTA 5 until GTA 6 comes out. Lethal Company. Best shared channel. Uh, because two or more is better. I'm not hating on GTA by the way. Best game ever made. But. Come on, like we gotta we gotta move on to the fucking next one, please. Right? Half, 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 eventually half half of the fucking Twitch chat, half of the Twitch chatters wouldn't, wouldn't have even been alive when fucking Twi uh, when GTA Five came out. Half of y'all were like five. Two or more is better than one. This award goes to the collaborative or shared channel that offers the best entertainment the past year. RDC, NMP, Botez, or uh, Alvius Sanctuary. I don't know that one. I know Botez. But I feel like if it's group, shared channel is just two people. If it's group, I'm probably going to go RDC. 
Uh, best content org. Esports a content organization that's created the best content during the past year. Best stream series. Best reoccurring show series or repeat of 2023. Repeat event. Award recognized best in the episodic live streaming. Name your price, Austin Show. I watched that very, very minimally. So that is the only one that I'm putting. Uh, best streamed event. The most entertaining, enjoyable single event streamed in the past year. Creator Dodgeball, Wild West, the Sea Dog Charity Auction, seven days in. I didn't like seven days in. And I know that's going to piss people off. But seven days in was two hours of good clips and 175 hours of nothing uh if, if you were just wa if you were watching the clips on tiktok funniest shit in the world but if you're watching just like a random hour of seven days in it's just motherfuckers sitting in a bed like literally like just sitting there and I'm not, like, I'm not dissing the event. I thought it was a really good idea. But I think, I think it was a better idea for, like, an episode-esque thing than streaming. If that makes sense. Like, imagine if Kai filmed for seven days and split it up into, like, ten episodes. Like, that would be really good because it would be edited down to where it's, like, really condensable and very watchable. But, like, we would watch some of the seven days in, and a lot of it was just, like, literally people sitting there. I'm going to go Creator Dodgeball just because it was, like, a short event. Best international stream. Ah, oh, God. But, like, Creator Dodgeball is so much easier to set up than seven days in. Like, seven days in, like, I have my, my fucking gripes with it, but it really was a, it, like, it was a good idea. And the Sea Dog charity auction was fucking great. I'm surprised the uh, the fucking um, like bikeathon isn't in this, but I don't know if that counts as an event. Oh, single event, so it was multiple. Uh, I'm gonna go seven days in. Best international streamer, the top streamer excelling in content creation for a global audience, specifically catering to an international or non-North American English-speaking audience. The only one I know of is Quackity. Best breakthrough streamer. You may have not have heard of them, but in the past year, everybody knows their name. This award goes to a streamer who has unprecedented growth and rose to uh, streamer fame over the last year and established themselves to be among the top streamers. Dude, the only... I don't even know why Squeaks and Max are in this. Queso and Jinxie are the only people that have even the potentiality of winning. Like, I, they're going to get so many votes... And, like, no, okay, these two had great years, right? Squeaks grew a lot, fucking, like, but, dude, growing from 100 viewers to, like, 5K viewers versus Queso. Dude, let me pull up Queso's Twitch tracker. This motherfucker has, and Jinxie, but, I mean, Jinxie had a slower growth. Queso went from, okay, this is 2023. Queso started a year ago. One year ago. Queso had 189 average viewers. And then, dude, it was like, I remember watching him play fucking Hogwarts in March. I watched that motherfucker when he had a thousand viewers. And I was like, yo, he's pretty entertaining. And then he just fucking, oh my god, 56,000 viewers. Like, that is the most insane growth ever. I wonder what Jinxies looks like. Jinxies was def- Jinxies been a longer streamer, so it's probably gonna be- Yeah, Jinxies was like the real streamer grind. Like, this motherfucker was streaming 200 hours a month. With 50 viewers. For years, right? And then, and then he fucking pops off. Averages like 800 viewers for like a year and a half and then just fucking skyrockets Dude, no way this month has been that much of a hike for him Like that's insane. All right, which one are we voting? If it's breakthrough streamer, it has to be queso just because if you look a year back queso was unknown 
like people knew who Jinxie was a year ago. No one knew who fucking Queso was. Best VTuber. <laughs> Best just chatting streamer. Like bro. Like bro. They put five on this one. They couldn't throw in like everyone. And then at, at least I could get like 0.5% of the votes. Best streamer that regularly does just chatting, such as conver conversing with chat. I put conversing. Video commentary reacting to news, bro. Sharing engaging stories, entertaining group activities, and the like. Pay money wubby. Pay money wubby. In terms of entertainment, pay money wubby does a way better job than everybody else here. Because a lot of these people just sit there. You're not on here. Well, I'm not I'm not saying I'm better than a lot of these guys. I've seen multiple clips where all four are just chilling. Pay Money Wubby constantly doing events. Always doing something where he's like fucking engaging with chat. It's always it, every day is like a new fucking event. Best variety streamer. XQC, Ludwig, C Dog, Queso, and Foosley. I don't know if I can vote Queso for this because I really don't classify Queso as variety. I would say Queso is small variety with heavy leaning on horror. Queso does mainly horror. Okay, also, I just looked up Queso's Twitch tracker and I looked it up the other day. He has 25 hours this month in 60 seconds. Anybody remember that game that I played where, like, you grab shit and then you just, like, it's like nuke. It's like a nuke. And then you sit in a bunker. Dude, he has 25 hours in fucking 60 seconds. How? Like, I, like, how? I, I don't, I don't know a game that I played that. Like, what is my, what does my Twitch tracker look like? What the fuck did I play this month? In the past month, this is what I've done. Hold up. Just chatting 37 hours. Minecraft 13.9. Fortnite buckshot lead. I, I do I do like just ran like I play too many games. Like half of the games I play, I'm playing for like a half hour. But like this is mine. And then if you pull up to Queso's, it's horror and then just 60 seconds. Kid Chameleon for the hundred dollar dono says best hot tub streamer. I don't think they would ever make that a category. Thank you for the 100. Kid Chameleon, you fucking goat. Dumb in the chat for that shit. Nika for the sub. Dawson for the sub. Dylan for the thousand biddies. Have you played Walking Dead Telltale series? Yeah, two years ago I did. Waffle for the five. First time I want to say I love the philosophy streams while on streams. I was wondering if you had ever considered playing any of the Batman Arkham games. Mm. They just look very slow paced to me, so I don't know. But if you have any games you want me to play, send them in the video suggestion tab, game slash tab on Discord. Exclamation point Discord. Mods in the Discord link. If you have any games you want me to play or videos you want me to react to, send those there. Video suggestion tab. Game snap dad. Thoughts on the Chiefs Ravens game? I'm taking the Ravens. Waffle for the four. First stone I want to say. Alrighty, read that. Juana for the fucking three. If you think about it, nothing can only be negative and nothing can only be positive because there's always an opposite to that one negative or positive thing. Exactly. There can't be positive without negative. And vice versa. Bibalicious for the three. I want to start streaming in the next few months. Any tips for getting started? Buy a cheap setup. Uh, really push short form content to gain an audience in long form. Rachel for the five. My brother got accepted into college at Rowan Engineering with a nine thousand dollar a year scholarship. Uh, scholarship. Could you say congrats, Aiden? Congrats, Aiden. That's fucking dope. Sucksky for the three. Much love. Uh, Kibo for the ten says no. I love GTA for the five. Can you buy me Iron Maiden concert tickets? No. Low Mock for the five. Stream of the year right behind me. Uh, Sugar for the sub. I love Joe Bar for the three. How much do I have to donate to get a few thousand bar bucks? I have 215 bar bucks left. You have to do well on predictions. If you don't do well on predictions, you're never going to get bar bucks. AWS for the three. I was asking if you played more home safety hotline yesterday. No, I'm probably going to finish it either on Saturday or next Wednesday. Goes for the sub. Cyclops for the three. Today, we're doing random games after this. We're going to be playing uh, Suck Up, Trolley Problem, and then um, the Lancaster Leak. Then we're going to be hopping into Streamer, Modded, Lethal Company, Tomorrow's a react day. Saturday's going to be ready or not. Maybe home safety hotline. If not, probably an FMV game or some random shit. Maybe games with chat. Uh, we'll decide on the fucking fly 
after Ready or Not. Sunday's Reacts, Monday's Minecraft, Tuesday I'm off, Wednesday we're doing Poppy Playtime Chapter 3, maybe Home Safety Hotline. Next Thursday, I don't know. That's the schedule. Ghost for the Sub Cyclops for the three. Uh, Crip Baby, already with that. Kyle, Yabo, and Pedro for the sub. Big and Nika for the sub. And Kid, thank you for the fucking $100 dono again, dude. Fucking goat. All right. Who are we voting for best variety streamer, chat? Didn't you already play Trolley Problem? No. I played the online Google version. They actually have a game that's much different. Or it's same premise that it's Trolley Problems, but it's much more in depth. Uh, Kyle and Mag for the sub. Ludwig? I haven't watched... I used to watch Lud... I used to be like a Ludwig stan. I used to watch Ludwig every day in like the COVID era, but now I don't. The only streamer I consistently watch here is Queso. And not even that consistently. Like I'll watch him like maybe like 15 minutes every night. XQC I never watch. Foosley never watch. Dog I'll watch if it's like a big event. I feel like I have to still vote Ludwig, though, because he really does variety. The Sapphire Award. Best female slash marginalized gender streamer of the year. Award recognized for a streamer who, like a Sapphire, is formed against the odds in an industry where 97% of the top streamers are male. 97% of the fucking of Twitch streamers are male. Of top streamers. I'm assuming they mean the top 5% on Twitch. Cuz if you go if you go down like top 20% of Twitch, there's a lot of women, but I will say the top 5% is very male dominated. This award is dedicated to a streamer who identifies as female or marginalized gender has excelled in entertainment at the highest level this past year. Emmeru, Extra Emily, Lydia Violet, Fan Fan and Valkyrie. Or Valky Ray. Valkyrie, I always say, because that it's it looks like Valkyrie. I'm probably gonna go. I know you guys are saying Valkyrie. I kind of want to go Emiru. Because I always see clips of Emiru way more. League of Their Own. The streamer's a pioneer that creates one-of-a-kind content with a creative and out-of-the-box thinking. Trailblazer in the streaming industry, somebody who relies on themselves for their content ideas and genuinely League of Their Own. I don't know any of these people, but I really want to vote Hitch because it looks like he goes hiking. <laughs> Gamer of the year. Streamer who has extraordinary gaming abilities. Oh, Shroud's on this list. Fucking shocker. Has performed exceptionally at a variety of games over the past year. No matter what they're playing, you have to watch. <laughs> I don't know about Jinxie. <laughs> What games is Jinxie good at outside of Rainbow? Because <laughs> it says, it says at a variety of games. What games is Jinxie? Oh, he's good at Madden. I bro, but saying being good at Madden, it doesn't transfer to like other games. I'm really surprised, dude. You know what it is? It's because he plays fucking controller. If he was like somehow a keyboard R6 player, even though I know he plays on Xbox. He would have immediate skill transfer to, like, Val, CSGO, and all of those games. Kaide's really good. Tarik, I'm not voting. Clicks, I'm not voting because he made fun of my voice. Uh, Shroud, um... Shroud, I'm not voting. Shroud's been in the game too long, buddy. Gotta fucking... Gotta eliminate you there. I'm gonna go Kaide. Streamer of the year. Uh, the best overall streamer of the past year. They saw great success with their entertaining content, elevated their brand, and, gen and left... And in general, left their mark on viewers. For me, it's between Jinxie and Queso. Kai, Quackity, and Iron Mouse are not in, in the question. They have had such growth over the last year. They're bigger than, than Kai. Both of them are bigger than Kai now. Maybe not name-wise, but viewership. These guys pull. Queso carried... Ah, dude, that's, like, really a hard choice between Queso and Jinxie. Queso appeals more to me, though, in the sense that, like, it's just more of the games that I play. 
Like, I watch Jinxie, and I'll watch him play Rainbow, and I've played Rainbow, but, I, like, it, it, a lot of the content's Rainbow, but Jinxie also has gone into more variety now. He does, like, fan mail openings and just chatting and shit. Most people are saying Queso. I'll go Queso. I'll go Queso, because I already voted Queso for... I What did I vote him? Best variety streamer? No, I didn't. What did I, what did I vote Queso for before? Oh, Breakthrough. All right. Well, that's the list. Chat, go vote, by the way. Let me submit that. Votes have been submitted. All right. Fucking, fucking W, 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 uh, nominations or not nominations, votes this year. I feel like last year we did this and I didn't know like anyone on that list, but now I actually know a lot of the streamers. Corruption for the sub, Pedro for the five. Bid sub for 19 months. I've been watching since the end of eighth grade. I'm a junior now. I really enjoy all your content. I want to say thanks for all the content you give us. I hope you have a great day. Thank you for the fucking nice ass message. Thank you for the fucking long term support and the 500 biddies, Pedro. Why for the sub, uh, Maggie, Kyle, your boy, Pedro, Big, and Nico for the sub again. All right. I really hope Handsome wins Rising Star. Dude, that would be sick. And to watch him get up on stage with his deep-ass, sexy voice and be like, thank you. I very much, I, I wanted to thank my my family. I wanted to thank my, my, my followers and all the genuine support I have had over the past year. Dude, I can't even get my voice his his level of deep. Have you guys heard Handsome? A lot of you guys might not know Handsome. We're playing with him again today. I played with him on uh, the Minecraft tournament. Hold up. Listen to his voice. It's so deep. When you hear him today, you're going to be like, what the fuck? Ladies and gentlemen, as you can see behind me, this is going to be this is a recurring segment that I haven't done in a hot minute. Wheel of Misfortune. I, I'm beating it's Minecraft. It's so deep. Dude, it's so deep. Craft. either I beat the game or we run out of sh on this list you'll see some familiar things on here and he's so fine tbh oh god see now uh, yeah like see now 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 we're gonna stop the combo god he's just like so attractive though god handsome's like so fucking sexy though no lie blur buff for the five jixie reacted to your tiktok about his pizza making skills yesterday yeah dude he dm'd me on twitter uh and he said it was funny i thought he already saw that video but i i mixed i mixed that one up with the Fortnite video he made because he reposted one of my other videos uh, Menace Unknown and Corruption for the sub. Yo, low-key, I wanted to be like, yo, if you want to stream one day. But then I would sound like that. Yo, I would just sound so fucking cringe. He was like, yo, that TikTok you made of me was mad funny. And I was, I just said him like, you know, like, uh, bro, I love your content. Thank you for that. Blah, blah, blah. You got a female's voice. What the fuck does that even mean? Anyways, dude, I wanted to be like, yo, if you want to stream one day, but if I said that shit, you know damn well that would just like him. I could already just be his consciousness reading my message and just be like, oh, that's so cringe. Oh, that's so cringe. Oh, if you want to hit up a game one day, oh, nothing in response. He didn't reply to me either. He put a he put a laughing emoji in response to my message. Chad, I think I whiffed the bag there. I think I whiffed the bag with Jinxie there. I think I, I think I had a potentiality on a second date there. I don't think it worked out. Uh, 23 for the three. I feel like Handsome sounds like Moist Critical. I would say Handsome has a deeper voice. Work for the sub, blur up for the five. I would say Handsome sounds more like... Um, who's the one guy that wears the night armor and covers his face? And he's been on YouTube for like 10 years. I'm blanking on his name. I know somebody's... A
Probably not. I don't really know. I don't even know what kick streamer. If you watch kick streamers, what kick streamers do you watch? I feel like the only kick streamers I know of are Neon and Aiden. And then what the fuck? What's that whack ass platform that Sneeko streams on? Oh my god. Rumble? Rumble or whatever? Do they fucking. How does Rumble make money? I don't understand that. Well, it's just advertising, just like YouTube, probably. What the fuck is Rumble? Exactly. Money laundering? Uh. I don't know if they I don't I don't know how they would make money through money laundering. Rumble ain't bad. I'm not dissing Rumble. I'm just saying nobody uses it. What flavor pot are you using? Um I think it's a mango mango passion fruit or some shit. I don't even remember. Tastes good though. Tastes mangoey. I know it has a little hint of something else that I can't discern. Okay. Are we ready, chat? New game. Lock in here. Do you guys know how to do you got do I re, do I need to re explain the game? I feel like I should re-explain a game here. Hold up, let me put in game capture. Do I need to re-explain a game here? All right. This is called Suck Up. I found this while frantically searching for a game to play today. <laughs> it's supposed it's very new. It's supposed to be popular. Um it is an AI based game. I am a vampire. My goal suck people's blood, right? Why the called why the game is called Suck Up. I go door to door like a salesman and I talk into my mic and I try to convince the AIs to let me into their house. When I get into the house, I fucking kill them. If I don't get into the house, I failed, right? And so where the AI comes in is the neighbor or not the neighbor, the person at the house is literally a, a high, not a conscious, but like a fucking intelligent AI that is going to respond to what I say in a human-esque way. Um, so I have to have a genuine conversation. I don't know. I, I'm assuming I'm going to have to read the voice lines. I doubt it's going to actually have, like, voice lines themselves. But they'll give me a genuine text response that would correlate to something that I would say to them. Dragonator Sam for the subhaven for the three. I finished playing the game Avatar Frontier on the Pandora. It's a uh, story game in a free world. Uh, you should take a look at the trailer. It's a good game. Could you send it to the game suggestion tab on Discord? Uh, sorry I keep asking that when people recommend games, but that's really where I search for the games. So if you have any games you want me to play or videos you want me to react to, I know I shout it all the time, but genuinely, if you have any games or videos you want me to react to, send those there. A cool vampire like you shouldn't be bumming it, it in the dump. Taking over somebody's house is as easy as giving them a little bite, but silly vampire rules dictate you need to get invited inside first. Dress to impress and use your wicked wit, use your wicked wit to win the invitation, but tread carefully. The local neighborhood watch is on patrol with eyes sharper than a wooden stake. Let me get all fitted up. I feel like I need to change the audio here. I don't like the fucking sound effects. That's pissing me off. All right. I'm all geared up, chat. Yo, do I look dripped out with my fucking three fingers? I look like Dobby the Elf. Dobby wants a sock. Oh, I got a black beanie on? Wow, no, this is just me. Okay. What is this shit? A uh, paper bag on the head? I don't really know if that... I feel like that makes me look more suspicious. I'm just going to go with... The, no, I look like a robber with the bean... Okay. All right. I don't want the cone head. I don't need the cone head here. Let's just go first door. Knock on the door. Well, now. Isn't it a little bit late for a young one like you to be out about? What can sweet old Granny Maud do for you, dear? What do I say? I have to record my voice. What do I say in response? I'm trying to get into her house. I feel like I should say I'm lost. I'm like lost. I'm cold. I'm lost and I'm cold. <laughs> what do I say? I can't just say that. That's suspicious. I gotta piece it together. I need a story here, Chad. I can't just say I'm cold. What are they gonna let me inside? They're gonna say, here's a fucking blanket. Get the fuck out of here. Ask to use her phone. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but what if she has a cell phone? Okay, whatever, whatever, whatever. Uh, hi, ma'am. I, I actually lost my family the other day. Oh, fuck. 
Wow. Alright, I need a lock-in. I need a lock-in for the fucking answers here. <laughs> it worked? Oh my dear, that's terrible news. Losing your family must be so hard for you. Why don't you come inside and like Granny Mod give you a comforting cup of tea? Oh, that would be great. I am very cold and hungry. Kebab! Oh, look at this fucking dumb bitch, chat. We're about to fucking kill her. Oh, well, bless your hearts, dear. Come on in and Granny Maud will whip up a warm meal for you. We'll get you all cozy and fed in no time. Don't you worry. How do I come in? Thank you. Can I just, like, come in? Can I just come inside? Or is she gonna uh -huh. fucking... It's my pleasure to help. Now, why don't you take a seat at the table while I wrestle you up some delicious goodness for you? Oh, sounds great. Dude, what the fuck? Is she gonna let me in the house, or are we just gonna uh -huh. continuously have to... Wonderful, darling. You make yourself at home. Old Grady Mod works in our kitchen in the kitchen. I... Works for magic in the kitchen. I've got an old family recipe for chicken pot pie. Ah, bitch, I don't want to eat that. How do I fucking move? How do... Just walk in? I can't. Can I come in now? <laughs> Bitch! I just had the in and now she's not letting me in! What the fuck? Juana says that you missed their bits. Juana, for the thousand biddies, you missed my uh, bits of the previous message. Do you mind reading it? Dragonator and Sam for the sub haven for the three. Um, where are your bits? Oh. I'm taking world religion semester and I really wrote it'll be hard. I just don't know what to expect. I took ethics and philosophy this semester. I really liked it. Just wondering what do you think about it? I remember hearing you say you took it. Also, totally off topic, hypothetically speaking, if you and Brooke were ever broke up, would you leave social media? I mean, I don't plan on ever breaking up with Brooke, and why would that indicate me leaving social media? Anyways, um, taking world religion semester. Uh, I mean, it's going to be similar to a philosophy class. You're just going to be learning theology instead of just base philosophy. Just study, study whatever the text that you're reading, and you'll be fine. All right. Lock back in here, chat. Uh, oh, well, dear, you've definitely tugged, certainly tugged at Granny Maud's heartstrings. Before we let you in, can you tell me a little more about yourself? Just to put Granny's mind at ease, you understand? Fuck. Say you're a painter? I'm not gonna tell her I'm a fucking painter. <sighs> yeah, my name's Mark. I'm actually an orphan. Uh, I've been moving from foster home to foster home, and I'm just really trying to find a place to stay. But right now, I need to get out of the cold. Locked in. Perfect. Ta oh, dear, Mark, you poor thing. You can't stay out in the cold. Come in, boy. Granny Maud will make sure you have a warm bed. <laughs> Kill that bitch! Kill that bitch! Should have baked more garlic bread. Oh my god, I can wear her outfit. <laughs> Where's your stuff? Granny Maud, where's what's it why do you have nothing in your house? Empty ass house on oh, the bat now. What the fuck? I'm assuming that's how I evade people. I'm gonna dress up as Granny Maud. I, I do need disguises. Oh, there's the neighborhood watch. Oh, shit. How do I evade them? And I have to go to the next house? Do you think he'll see me? Can I hop fences and shit? No, we just go next house. Oh, God. This guy's tweaking. He's not gonna let us in. Hey, yo, what's cracking, Grandma Maud? What's with the late night knock? Got some hot tea spilling or what? Oh, 
Oh, hello, little swipe. My power just went out and I've been really needing a shower. I was wondering if I could use your bathroom. Oh, hello. Fuck! Uh... Oh, man. Sorry, Grandma. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, I'm naked! Shit! Shit! I'm naked! I need clothes, they're not gonna let me in looking like this! Oh my god, he's going to investigate. Chat, what the fuck do I do? Seem more fucking in innocent? Dude, how do I seem more innocent? Oh, I can leave through the backyard. Clutch. Chat, I need to get a fucking outfit. Oh, that's not gonna make me look sus. We're in a Michael Myers fucking mask. I have a duffel bag in my in my hand too. I don't really know if I'm gonna be able to convince somebody here. Mm. Yeah, let's try and get into a house. <laughs> or oh, Jason Mass, not Michael Myers. Chat. All right, shut up. Oh fuck. All right, well we'll knock on this door. Hey, hello, hello. Whoa, Sony Toprano. Sony Toprano. Well, well, well. What do we got here? If you think you can waltz up to my door looking like that, you're in a world of hurt, pal. Scram before I introduce you to my friend, Mr. Baseball Bat. I feel like I should say that I'm with, like, the, the local lumberjack union. And I need to take a look at his backyard trees. Or something like that. What should I say? Oh, trick or treat. Trick or treat. Fire. Fire. Trick or treat, huh? You think this is some kind of kitty game? I'll let you. I'll, I'll tell you what. You better have some value, something valuable to offer if you want to get on my good side. Otherwise, you'll be leaving empty-handed. Now, what's it gonna be? Fuck, what could I offer him? What could I offer him? A costume party? I could say I'd give him my axe. Head? God, the fact that I, if I'm gonna say this, I actually have to say this out loud. Oh, like, I can't type it. Oh, God. Oh, I'm going to say it. I have to build up the courage. I could pleasure you in many different ways, Sony Toprano. <laughs> he fucking kicked me out. Oh, shit. He doesn't even have, oh, I was gonna say he doesn't even have trees in his backyard. Bro, I need a fucking outfit. I'm butt naked. Oh my god, yo, I could really pull a, like, hey, somebody was trying to fucking kidnap me. You think they'd let me in their house? You think if I go back up to his door, oh shit. You think if I go back up to his door, he'll know that it's me? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Chat. Chat. I could deliver food. Fuck, jump, dude. Fuck. Yeah, I'm a DoorDash driver. But why would they want why would they be okay with letting me inside? Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll go back to this guy's house cuz he's a stoner. What's up, fam? You here with the midnight snack delivery? I've been craving some fire all night. Let's get this party started. What do you think he'd like? Little Caesars, hot and ready. Ready for you to let me in your house and give you some pizza. Oh, that's definitely... That's definitely some... Mm -hmm. Yo! Little Caesars in the house? Pizza sounds lit. But you gotta prove you got those fresh slices. 
Let's see what you got, my dude. Show me those goods. As a part of company policy, I'm not actually allowed to let you uh, see the pizza until I come in the, inside the house. Mm -hmm. Fuck! Fuck! Why was the grandma so easy? Now this one's impossible. Mm. Oh my god, yo, bitch. I'm about to wear the... Mm. Chat, we're... I'm trying the DoorDash thing again. We surely clutch up the DoorDash thing again. Bro said stay crispy. God, should I just like sell drugs or something like that? I should I feel like I should be like, oh, I'm here with a crack. I'm here with a crack. Do you want do you want crack? I have drugs. This guy looks rich. Ooh, boxed meal. <gasps> Hello fresh. Oh my god. Oh my god, chat. This is the one. I'm right. Charles A. Boomer. What in tar nation are you bothering me at this ungodly hour? I ain't ordered no fancy box meal, so take it back where it came from. Bitch, it was on your fucking front porch. Sir, you're being served in the court of law. Your ex-wife is actually filing a divorce, and I'm here to deliver the papers. Mind if I take a step inside? Hello. Chat, we are failing miserably right now. What's a new strategy, chat? I need a new strategy here. I need to get the fuck out of here before the cop shows up. Hold up. Dude, how do I fucking convince people to let me in their house? I don't want to wear the fucking Jason mask. Oh my god, the Jason masks will work on that stoner dude. Yo, the Jason masks will, work, will definitely work on that stoner dude. Because that guy's a fucking idiot. Say so you have a warrant? I would have to dress up as a police officer. What is that? Gray wavy hair. Yeah, it works. It works. It works. Bruh, what's cracking? Not gonna lie, this ain't the best time for a surprise visit. We good out here or nah? I don't want to say trick or treat to him, because he said he's busy. What should I say? What is he wearing, by the way? It looks like he has a walkie-talkie in his hand. I feel like I could, like, fucking convince him to let me in. Costume party, bro. You got drugs? You trying to buy some drugs, bro? I don't think that's going to work. Nah, man. I'm all about that music grind, you feel me? I ain't into the drug scene, so sorry to disappoint. But hey, if you need some fire beats, I got you covered. Oh, God, I got a dick ride him here. Hold up. Oh, that's so cool. What type of music do you make, man? I've always been interested in learning how to make some sick beats. The hell, the hell. Hey, well, that's like what I like to hear, bro. I make all kinds of music from trap to hip top to lo-fi beats. If you're down to learn, I can show you the ropes and help you make those sick beats. Just promise me, just promise me you'll put some respect on Lil Swipe's name when you blow up, alright? I'm so down, little homie. What's the first step in making some sick beats? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, my dude. First step is getting some good beat making software like FL Studio or Ableton. We can buy, is, are those real software? Kill your bitches! I'm a hero up. Put on a shit. We get the fuck out of here, chat. Good fucking shit. Yeah, you gotta read the vibe. You gotta read the vibe, then you know what's going on. What the fuck's over here, by the way? Oh, is this more of the neighborhood? 
Oh, these are like fucking rich ass houses. Oh god, dude, this neighborhood's fucking huge. Dude, I thought it was gonna be like ten houses. There's like fucking a hundred homes here. What house should we try? Oh, look at that big ass mansion up top. Yo, you think we'd be able to convince our way into there? I'm about to sneak past this cop though. Oh. All right, we gotta see who opens the door. Oh fuck. Ah, oh, it's Karen. Uh -huh. Fuck. Oh great. Just the person I wanted to see at my doorstep in the middle of the night. Well, little swipe, I hope you have a good excuse for discerning my beauty sleep. I have to say, I have to say something about, um, because they have, like, personalities. Uh, what, what would, like, a Karen vibe with? I have to complain about someone. I was actually looking to join the neighborhood watch if you had any, um, inclinations on how I could do so. Well, I must admit, keeping our neighborhood safe is of um, utmost importance. But I need to ask you a few questions before I consider your application. Have you had any experience with surveillance cameras? <laughs> That's my in. That's my in. Yeah, I actually used to work with installing them for a couple years back right after high school. Uh, right now, I just do an accounting job, but I'd love to be able to get back into the loop. Tell her she's pretty? Terrible fucking idea. Oh, how marvelous! We could certainly need somebody with technical expertise like yourself. Could you maybe show me some of your previous camera installations on your fancy phone? That would help me assess your skills better. Hmm. Well, the camera installations actually aren't hooked up to the phone. They're hooked up to a computer wiring system. I'd be happy to install them into your house and, and let you see them yourself. Mm, I stuttered there. Uh -huh. Fuck, 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 fuck. Wait a minute. You want to install surveillance cameras in my house? That's a bit extreme, don't you think? I think we need to have a little chat about our privacy and boundaries here. Well, ma'am, I've heard from around the loop in the neighborhood that people are trying to get to you and get into your house. So I was just trying to protect your safety. If you don't want uh, that help, I, can't, I don't know what else. Fuck! I stuttered. I stuttered. I stuttered. Oh my god, wait, I can re-record. I can re-record. Sorry for breaching privacy, ma'am, but I heard from a little birdie that people are trying to break into your house. And I was just trying to keep your safety at the utmost importance. If you don't care about that, that's fine, though. Mmm, clutch. Mmm, clutch. Mmm, clutch. Mmm, clutch. Chat, that's ah. fucking... Okay. Guilt tripping does not work on the Karen. Guilt tripping does not work on the Karen, chat. I don't know what we're gonna do here. I don't know what we're gonna do here, but it does not work there. Fuck. Oh, chat, what do we do? Ask her to be your valentine? No. Get the shit off my back. Wear a Santa hat. I don't really think that's gonna help me. Just agree with her? Yeah, I really have to just dick ride. What the fuck is this? <gasps> right here. We'll stop here. I'm gonna say I'm selling Girl Scout cookies. Oh, fuck. Father Prince. Praise the Lord, my colorful friend. How may I assist you on this glorious evening? I'm actually here to sell Girl Scout cookies. Do you want to buy any? Hello, I'm Girl Scout cookies, my apologies, but I am on a strict diet of humility and self-discipline. I must respectfully decline your tempering off. <sighs> oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god, chat. This is such a hard game. This is such a hard game. Holy shit. I'm naked again. And there's a cop. I'm running. Am I back at the fucking start? Where am I? 
Whose house is this? Who the fuck? <laughs> B.L. Liver. Greetings, fellow seeker of unraveling truths. What brings you to my abode in such an eccentric manner? Might your jet-propelled journeys be linked to the secretive dealings of Shadow Elite, or do you bear news of an impeding extraterrestrial invasion? Pray do tell. Hello, kind squire. I've been learning about uh, the game Dungeons and Dragons recently, and I was seeing if you were uh, able to take part. I may be misreading mm -hmm. this. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I read that. I read that perfectly. Read that fucking bitch perfectly, chat. Ah, Dungeons and Dragons. A labyrinth tapestry of ancient lore and fabled quests. Fabled quests. I've traversed those Halloween realms in the pursuit of forbidden knowledge. So tell me, gallant adventurer, what treacherous lands and mythical being captive your imagine captivate your imagination in this captivating game? Chat, what's a character for fucking Dungeons and Dragons? What's a character from Dungeons and Dragons? <sighs> give me like, give me like a a bard, a dwarf. My favorite character is actually a dwarf, and I'm trying to battle a demigorgon, but I need a teammate's help. Is there any way you could help me out? Oh my god. Clutch, clutch. <laughs> a demigorgon, you say? A creature of uns- I changed his voice, but this one's better. A creature of unspeakable darkness and power. What the fuck? How did bro like what did I do wrong though? I was in I was in there. I was in there, chat. Like I had that shit fucking down packed. Sombrero. Oh, this is where I started. Alright, we gotta leave this area. Oh, I could get some other stuff there though. I'm holding a mini fridge on my backpack. I'm gonna go to a different I'm gonna go to a different part of the neighborhood. Chat, what am I wearing right now? It has to fit what we're doing. Actually, it doesn't. I feel like all you just have to not be, like, scary. And then they might let you in. Well, hello there, my darling. What brings you to my doorstep at this ungodly hour? You look positively cheery with that backpack, helmet, and fridge contraption. She's wearing gloves, so I'm assuming she cleans things. Should we try and sell her cleaning material? Or, like, baking goods? Because she's wearing an apron and gloves. Say so you're a Jehovah's Witness. Oh my god, I gotta say that at the other guys! <gasps> the priest, I gotta say- Oh, she's gardening. I happened to see your wonderful garden, and I was wondering if you were in need of any new tools. I wish you were. Oh, bless your heart of thinking of me and my garden. I must say, I could always use some new tools. What do you have in mind, dear? What's like a really good gardening tool? Sell her a shovel. Did I miss Lethal Company? Nah, we're playing that in like 45 minutes. Bro, what should I fucking sell her, chat? This game's fire, by the way. Like, them literally having a conversation with me. An axe? Dude, I feel like that's scary. A spade. A lawnmower? No, she wants a garden. That cop is right next to me. Um, weed puller 9... Yeah, the weed puller 9,000. I'm actually marketing the weed puller 9,000. It'll get rid of every weed in your garden, and you'll never have to deal with any of them ever again. Oh, I feel like that's too good to be true. Oh, I prefer tending to my garden with my own two hands, I'm afraid. Bitch. <sighs> yes. 
And I had to get naked now. Because he was gonna fucking spot me. Oh my god, I look like a doctor. Yo. This is about to work so well. Holy shit. Dr. Vicky, well, well, what do we have here? Another late night visitor to disturb me? What brings you to my door this time? Speak up, I haven't gotten all night. Dr. Vicky, you don't recognize me? I've been working with you for three years. I have urgent news about a new virus that's breaking out. We must talk about it now. Oh, really? Urgent news, you say? Well, don't keep me waiting. Spill the details, but let's keep it hushed. We don't want anyone else snooping around. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Um. Uh. There's a new disease going around called Mr. Beast AIDS. It's in our tap water. Have you drinking tap water today? Hmm. <laughs> That was going so well, too. I feel like I should just pan to somebody like I need help. Where was that priest's house? Is this the priest's house? I can't remember. Oh, my God. Millie and Neil. Hey, welcome to the party. Looks like you're already dressed for a wild night. Uh, just uh, make sure to keep those moves outside, okay? Living, hashtag living my best life. I feel like I should try and sell her drugs. Your friend actually told me to come here. Said you guys were low on LSD. Do you need any? Ah, uh, LSD might be too far. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. No party here, no drugs. Try the house next door. Bitch, what? Literally said there was a party going on. Guess there wasn't. Snooze fest. Scary. Michelle Maple. Good day there, bud. Not sure if you took a wrong turn, but this ain't no clothing optional makeup syrup festival. Please help! There's a man in a Jason mask. Help! He's running at me. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. Yo, I need to be able to fucking... No, 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 no. Oh my god, I'm gonna get the door slammed oh, in my face. My I can't mom. stutter. Oh. Fuck. Chat, we are like, we're like two for fucking 50 right now. I need to get an outfit. What's a good outfit I could wear? A fucking beanie? God, there's so many cops everywhere too. Dude, I don't know whose house I could go up to. This guy. Oh, uh, what was this one? I wanted him to let. I wanted uh, him to let me into his house. Oh yeah. Listen here, you little varmint. I don't care who you think you are, but I ain't letting you step foot of my. Oh, it's because I'm wearing the same outfit. Wait, now we do this. Hello. Now he doesn't recognize me. What entire nations are you doing knocking on my door at this ungodly hour wearing that ridiculous getup? State your business before I get real ornery. What does ornery mean? Use the toilet? No. What should I fucking... This is some old rich guy. Well, how do I get an old rich guy to fucking let me in? I've been going door to door talking about our economy. I wanted to know what are your thoughts on our current president, Charles A. Boomer. Hello. 
Oh! Hop the fucking fence! Shit! Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, chat, we're killing this guy. We're gonna run this one back. We're gonna run this one back until I fucking murder him. What could I ask him? What do I say to this fucking guy? I an investment opportunity, maybe? Well, hello there, kind sir. I just moved into town, and I was wondering if there was any other stock-loving, golf-loving individual I could be with. Oh my god, that sounded that sounded like I want to have a relationship with him. Uh. Stock-loving, golfing-loving individual? Well, I'll be in. Ain't nothing wrong with a good game of golf and some wise stock investments, I reckon. Though I ain't sure about letting a stranger into my house just yet. What should I say about fucking stocks or golf? How do I convince him? Say you're good in bed. Chat, I don't think that's going to fucking help. What do I say about stocks? I've been recently getting into ETFs, and I just bought a new set of golf clubs, as you can see on my back here. Been meaning to try out this new fucking golfing wedge. I just cursed. Oh my god, he's going to hate that. Oh, yeah. Okay. We almost throw. We almost throw. Now hold your horses there, fella. No need to use that fancy language. And before you start swinging them golf clubs around, I reckon it's best you find a proper golf course. Don't want you swinging them things near my house. My apologies, sir. And I've been meaning to ask you, are there any good golf courses around here? Been needed to find a partner to go with. Whoa. Well, I'll be darned. Turns out we might have a bit in common after all. There's a even go decent golf course not too far from here called Fairway Meadows. If you're looking for a golf partner, I might just be in game. But you'll first have to prove me... Wait, but you'll have to prove your swing first. Fuck. How do I... Okay, now we're on golf. Uh... How do I prove to him that I am a fucking avid golfer? How do I prove to him that I'm at? Keep on golfing. Ask to use the bathroom. Do you understand the game right now, WTF Man 69? Do you understand what is happening right now? Hold up. Brooks fucking. Hello? I have the answer. You have the answer to what? I have no problem proving my swing. Do you have the wrong number of signs that I can use? Alright, that's actually clutch. Alright, love you. Bye. I think she's watching my stream. She said, ask for golf clubs inside. <clears throat> I'll be happy to show you my swing. Do you have any, uh, your golf clubs that I could use? Oh my god, but I have golf clubs on my fucking back. <gasps> well, I'll be- Oh, darn! Looks like you're se you're serious about this golf business. I reckon I could lend you a spare set of clubs I got. Just promise me you won't go slinging them around like a wild bear, all right? Don't you dare scratch them. Don't you worry, Charles A. Boomer. I'll take good care of your golf clubs. Now, where are they? Well, I guess you won me over, golfer. The clubs are in the garage. Come on in and let's have ourselves a good old golfing time. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Psych, bitch! Back in my day, we had real vampires, and now I'm going to be him. Now I am now I'm uh, now I am Charles A. Boomer, the avid golfer. W. Brook actually came in fucking clutch there.
Yo, we gotta go to that house up top. Over here. This looks like a rich person. What do they got around here? A little backpack. Sleek backpack. Boxed meal. I'm gonna say it got delivered to the wrong address. Spark conversation. Mr. East. Is this supposed to be Mr. Beast? Hey there, golf extraordinaire. What brings you to my humble abode at this ungodly hour? I'm all ears and ready for some wacky adventures, just like on the golf course. I actually had this uh, HelloFresh box delivered to my address wrongly, and I know that you love that stuff, so I wanted to return it to you. By the way, what have you been up to recently? I'm cooking. I'm cooking. I'm cooking. Oh, wow, you're too kind. Thanks. I keep doing the country accent. I gotta stop. Thanks for returning to HelloFresh box. It's like winning a giveaway. As for what I've been up to, I've been working on some new content for my channel. <laughs> Exploring different games and sharing all the amazing experience with, uh, experiences with my awesome subscribers. What about you? Anything exciting happening in your world? I've actually been getting uh, into YouTube myself, and I was wondering if you had any uh, tips on how to start a growing channel. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic! Congrats on starting your YouTube journey. I'd be more than happy to share some tips to help you grow your channel. Why don't you come inside? Wow, this guy was way too easy to fucking kill. Okay. <laughs> that was like that was like not even a challenge. That was that was almost immediate. I I almost instantaneously killed him. That was not Mr. Oh, not. Oh, no way. Am I soft locked? Okay, no, we're good. I was going to say, I think I just got fucking stuck. I really want to go to that hippie house again. Because I think they'll like me if I'm Mr. Beast. Oh, that's right there. Is it this house? I don't remember. I ditched a lot of stuff here. We're going to see. Oh, it's the. Oh, my God. It's the priest. Ah, my dear friend, how delightful to see you at the door. May your blessings, may the blessings of the heavens rain upon you. And may the blessings of the heavens rain upon you as well, Father Prince. I have an upcoming video idea that I think I might need your help with. <laughs> my dear friend, I'm always eager to aid in spreading the message of salvation. Please do enlighten me about your video idea. We're going to be going to third world countries, spreading the news about your religion, and actually donating new homes to people in need. Would you be interested? Ah, <laughs> I got it! Hallelujah! What a magnificent endeavor. I, can't, I gotta stop doing the country accent. Spreading the word of God while providing shelter. To, I kind of feel bad that I'm like scamming this guy. Well, providing shelter to those in need is truly a noble mission. Count me in, my friend, for I am ready to embark on this righteous journey with you. I feel like I, 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 I went through the story too fast. What do I say now? Mind if I come inside and talk about the flight plans? Trying to get this video out within the next month, so... Gonna see when your schedule works up with mine. Oh my god, that didn't fucking make any sense, chat. That didn't make any sense. Oh, fuck. Let's let's hope it slides. Let's hope it slides. Uh -huh. Okay, good shit. Uh -huh. Oh, blessed day. Come in, come in, my friend. Let us discuss the flight plans and allow our schedules. For time is of the essence. Oh my god, chat. I'm getting way too good at this. I'm getting, I'm getting way too good at this. It is like... Dead. 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 Where's his hat? I think being Mr. Beast really helps out, chat. I think if I'm just constantly Mr. Beast, it's just very easy to kill people. I was, huh? Oh my god, finally! I've been craving this forever! You better not have messed up my order, Becky. Becky? Or I swear I'll destroy you. Oh, and thanks for bringing it all the way here, out here, loser.
Don't call me a loser, fucking Regina. Who the fucking shit do you think you are? I'm sitting here trying to make a living and you're making fun of me? Oh. I was messing with you. Plus, you clearly can't take a joke. Goodbye, loser. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm keeping your fucking hella fresh order, too, bitch. Fuck. Bitch ass motherfucker. Trying to tell me. Oh, shit. Trying to tell me I'm a fucking loser. I'll deliver it to the next person. Oh, God. <laughs> Preston Pomps. Ha, huh, late night ca uh, cake. Oh, I can't read. I can't read. I can't read. Ah, a late night caterer delivering a box meal. How very convenient. I suppose it'll have to suffice since my, ch my chef is off duty. Thank you, I suppose. Your chef is off duty? While I am delivering this package, I actually know how to cook myself. If you need a chef, I'm glad to help. So easy. So easy. When are you switching games? I'll kill two more people and then we'll switch. <laughs> oh, you're a caterer who can also cook? Well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to have an extra pair of hands in the kitchen for tonight's event. But mind you, I have high standards. Impress me and there may be a spot for you in my culinary entourage. I actually worked with Gordon Ramsay back in the 90s. I've been in the cooking game my entire life, and I love cooking up some good culinary cuisine. I should have said I was Guy Fieri. Uh -huh. Gordon Ramsay, you say? Impressive, though. It remains to be seen if you possess the same level of culinary prowess. Very well. I shall give you a chance to prove yourself. Prepare a dish that will leave me astounded, and perhaps I will consider inviting you into my exclusive circle of esteemed chefs. Well, sir, I don't have any ingredients on hand. Do you have anything in your house that I could possibly use to cook you up a good meal? And it's just like that, chat. Look, look, it's over right here. <sighs> Unfortunately, I do not keep a fully stocked pantry for just any caterer. However, if you can't work with what you have, perhaps your skills aren't as remarkable as you claim them to be. Nevertheless, I can spare a few basic ingredients if you think you can create something truly extraordinary out of them. <sighs> what should I say? Sir, I could cook with anything you'd give me. Sir, I could cook with anything you'd give me. I could turn poop into gold. That's how good I am at cooking. Oh, that might have been... That might have been... A little over... Mm. I think I threw. Oh, wait, no, no. He's saying good day. He's letting me... Wait, 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 sir. Let me please show you my culinary prowess. I'd love to be in your inner circle, and I know that you would love to, me, love to have me as one of your best chefs. Oh, my God. I fucking repeated myself. I didn't sell. It's not over. It's not over. Oh, my God. 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 I didn't sell. I didn't sell. I didn't sell. But he said biggest fumble. Yeah, that's crazy. How about a fucking rip him to shreds? That simple. That simple, chat. All right, we'll kill one more person, then we'll switch. Oh, fuck! Dumbass. 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 Buddy got weaved. Buddy got weaved. What's this house? Kill the cop? I don't think I can. Oh. Hmm. Well, not that bad, but who? Hey there, groovy cat. What brings you uh, here under the moonlight? I heard about a nude pool party that's going on out back, and I was wondering if I was able to join. Hello, hello.
Oh, you're in luck, my friend. We do have a good pool party around here, but before I can invite you in, I'll need to know if you're comfortable with, you know, shedding those worldly garments and embracing your natural self. Are you ready to let it all hang out? Eve Breeze, I let it all hang out all day, every day. The only reason I'm out here with clothes is because I'm legally obligated to. If you let me in your house, I'll be sure to strip down. Oh, fucking hell. Wow, that I never thought I would say a sentence like that in my life. Well, my friend, you speak the language of liberation. If you're truly committed to the newest way of life, I believe we can truly trust you to honor our sacred space. Come on in, fellow free spirit. Let the clothes be gone. Wow, that was so easy. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not in yet. Come on in, fellow free spirit. Let the clothes be gone. What do I say? What do I say? Uh, thank you. Somebody said just say thanks. I don't know. Just remember, love and acceptance are the only just code here. Now let's celebrate this beautiful connection and dance our way into this magical experience together. I'd be glad to. Can you show me the way to the pool? Come on. Yes! And we're in. And we're in. And we're in. And then I fucking kill her. She doesn't even have a pool. She doesn't even have a pool, chat. She was literally naked wearing uh, a little fucking flotation uh, ducky inner tube with nothing else. That's literally it. All right. Well, that was a W game. Do you guys want to run that another day? Because there's like a million houses. Apparently, we only had a one-star rating, too. So I'd be down to run that another day. That was a fun-ass little game there. Yeah, we'll run that another day. I'll keep that game. Um, Hold up. I got to go pee real quick. Then we we only have like 15 minutes until we have to play uh, Lethal Company with the guys modded. Uh, So we might do... I don't know what we're going to do. We'll figure that out, but I got to fucking piss first. Chat, count me down... 30 seconds. It up. All right, chat, change of plans. We got a surprise guest here. Uh, I know. We got a surprise guest here. Uh, she said that she thinks she could do a better job than me uh, at Suck Up. So we're, you're going to have, I'll give you two tries to try and get in their house and kill them. I, I Should we run him, predictions? I gave him the one you gave hit. me one piece of advice. And you got in. I did get in. But you gave me one piece of advice. We'll run predictions. I'll let you do three houses. And and you're gonna pick the houses and, and it'll and it'll determine Did I hear that you were Mr. Beast? I was Mr. I am dressed as Mr. Beast. Like, Not alive really? for the sub, really for the sub. Like, Owen for the thousand, but he's among us for the sub ball. Meow and Caden for the sub, Kid for the ten. Free carpet cleaning estimate and they'll actually clean their carpet. Thatcher for the three. Bros literally Cardi. May for the sub. T Nichols, Joe Bart, Bonnet, four millimeter for the sub, Juana for the thousand biddies. Alright. Yeah, we'll are let you, you run it with once. What you think Mr. Beast looks like? Oh, I'm naked again. Mr. Beast? I'm naked again. Good. What? Are you dressed as what you think Mr. Beast looks like, or are you actually? I'm not like actually Mr. dressed as I was dressed as Mr. Beast, actually? but now, yeah, but now I'm in a hoodie and jeans. Can I move? All right, you. What outfit do you want to wear? I'll let you. Move. I'm gonna make you a construction worker. Construction. Can you just wear a hoodie and jeans then? I don't know where the fucking beanie went. Are you fine with wearing a paper bag on your head? No. Right, you don't want to wear a paper bag on your head? Chat, where did the beanie go? Okay. All 
All right, you have to avoid the cops, by the way. She keeps yelling at me. Get a okay, fine. A yeah, you can't run into the cops. What do you mean, run? <laughs> Ooh, it's warm. How do I walk? Oh. oh. Uh, W A S D would be move. Huh? W A S D would be move here. I'm gonna commentate because I know she's gonna be dead silent until she actually has to say something. Away? No, bust that right and go to that first door. Knock on that door. Yeah, knock on it. All right. Now, you, now you're you're gonna hold the right mouse. Well, you have to read what they say. I'll read what they say, and then you'll say your response. You'll be you. I'll be them. Brian, Bitcoin, right? So you have to. You're probably gonna have to talk about cryptocurrency. Hey there. Welcome to the crypto den. What can I do for you? Bitcoin to the moon, baby. You're gonna hold right click and talk into the mic. I'm a new finance bro, and I'm just trying to really get into stocks. Do you think you could help me out with that? He's not a stock guy. He's a crypto guy. What's the difference? We'll see. Oh, oh, like huh? Sorry, bro, but I'm all about the crypto game, as I said. That's not the same Stocks thing. ain't really my thing. And he slammed the door on you. All right, that was one out of the How is that not the same thing? Is it crypto? You got to run. The cop's coming. Ah! You got to run. Fuck, we ditched the outfit. We gotta get another outfit. All right, can that one not count? No, that one counts. No, <laughs> that one. That's counts. not fair. That was that was not unfair. You, you said stop. You told me to walk to that house. I know, and all you had to say, all you had to say was, "Yo, you don't go into the moon, brother," and then he would have fucking let you in. Joe picked I, that house because he knew I didn't it was know. gonna be a chat. Have we knew, gone there? He knew it was gonna be a crypto bro, and he knew that would be a question oh, he could answer, and that I couldn't. All right, you're going to this one. Everyone's saying it doesn't count. It doesn't count. All right, fine. It doesn't, it doesn't count. count. All right. That was the test run. Well, I usually do a voice for them. Tommy Twizzler. Is he drunk? Ahoy, matey! Ye be looking quite the jolly swashbuckler tonight. Avast! What be ye puckering tonight, me hearty? Is he a pirate? I'm not helping you at all. Is he drunk? I don't know. <laughs> oh, I'm dressed as a pirate! Yeah. Um... Ooh. Brooke's about to say, trick or treat, let me in your fucking house. Hello there, matey. I was just wondering if you had some brewskis you wouldn't mind sharing. Hello, hello, hello. Sorry, matey. No brewskis for ye tonight. The tavern be closed. I'll be fucking close the door on you. <laughs> you gotta run. You gotta run. You gotta run. All right, I'll control WASD. Just move. All right, go to this house. Knock on the door. Fuck! The cops see us. Bust that, bust that right. Turn right, turn right. Turn right, turn right. Yeah, it doesn't matter. They don't care if you're naked. Well, some of them do, but most of them don't. I jumped the fence. Bro, please, why are you holding the camera angle like this? How was it so easy? Turn right, turn right. When I helped you, it was Stop, stop, stop. I can't jump the fence. All right. All right, bust this left. Where the fuck are we? We're stuck in this backyard. Turn right. Turn right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, now we're out. Fuck. Now how come when I helped you... All right, go straight. Stop, stop. stop. Go straight. So simple. All right, this is your last try. Nah, you I have two a, more. You have this one and next one. You're not going to get a Swifty. Oh, maybe you just got a Swifty right here. Raven. Dude, what the actual heck are you doing in my house in the middle of the night with a hatchet? You, you picked up a hatchet? He's you better you better have a good explanation or I'm calling the cops. Bro, you got to work with what you have. Frick. There was a guy chasing me in the middle of the street and he dropped this and I picked this up and ran. Can I please come inside and we call the cops? Oh, you're... Yo, I'm predicting an instant deny here. Uh -huh. Wait, sir! Oh no, fucking way! No way! No way! No way! She lets her in this early. Of course, I totally understand. Thank you so much. I'm just so nervous. Bro, what? I did that before, and somebody just denied me. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just coming already. But listen, no funny business. Got it? Ah, oh, you got her. Fuck, dude. What? That was like a two. Quite. That was like a two Whoa. sentence conversation. You gotta tell her. Kill her. 
I'm gonna do it again. You oh. get one more. Am I naked now? Yeah, but now you're gonna wear her shit. I don't want to wear the pirate hat. Does she only have hair? Talk to Mike. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. I say talk to the mic and you start going ooh, ooh, I told ooh, you ooh, I ooh. needed a Swifty. She looks like she was a Swifty. We related. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Alright, you get one more house. You get to pick which one. Which one? That one. That house? Mm -hmm. Alright, you killed that guy. Oh. This one? Sure. Ha, ah, a daring technician at this late hour. How delightful. What mysterious inventions have you brought to enthrall my mind? The you. Him. You. Wait, 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 wait. But he, I'm going to help you here. He's wearing, he looks like he's an inventor. So you have to play off that. He has, a, he has like a weird jet pack. I think I just invented the first solar-powered jetpack, and I wanted to show you. That's actually probably a good line. <laughs> yeah, he liked that. Solar-powered... Wait, what was the voice that I was doing? Solar-powered jetpack, you say? How extraordinary! Show me, show me! I must witness this marvel of engineering. See, now you kind of fucking shot yourself in the foot here. Because, like, yeah, you have, you have to say... I, you have to give him a reasoning that you can't show him until you're inside. But don't just say that. Of course, but would you mind if I ran in and use your bathroom first? Oh, throw. I've been throw. working so hard all day. Can he hear you yelling throw? No. I'm sorry, my dear technician. My lair is not equipped with a bathroom. And he shut you out. Damn. You're one for four. You get... Bro, I have to go play Lethal. You get one more try, and then I gotta go play Lethal Company. Oh, the cops are on your ass? All right, you're gonna be naked at the next one. So you're really... If you clutch up here, my chat will respect you. You're butt naked here. All right, go. Can I read Click the both? door. Can I read both? Yeah, sure. Oh, uh, party, bro. You're good. Ow. What in the tarnation are you doing at my door without a stitch on you? Get gone before I call the sheriff. A stitch? Is that closed? A gun. A gun? He's holding. He has an AK-47 on his back. Oh, I thought that was part of his beer thing. Uh, get gone. What am I doing without one? Yeah, he's asking why you don't. Ha he's asking why you don't have a gun. Say the say the government took them. Bro, my stash got confiscated by the government last week, and I heard you got a big supply coming in, and I wanted to talk to you about it. Rip. Rip. Bro, if you were, uh... What did she do, chat? Two, one for five? I thought I was going to do so freaking one for five, good. One for five? I thought I was going to do so good. That was pretty upsetting. All right, can you uh, get up? No. Uh, Base Saul Goodman for the sub. Tommy Unold says happy birthday. Base Saul Goodman for the 20 gifted. Stop biting me. Base Saul Goodman, thank you for the fucking subs. Kid Chameleon for the 10. I already read that. Caden Meow Bolt. I already read that. Vinny for the fucking sub. Melon for the sub. Floating Kettle up for the three. Says Brooke Rose. Believe for the three. For Cyclops for the three. Where do you get the suck up game? Just Google it. Tommy for the three. Uh, it says happy birthday. Live it up, man. Not my birthday. Base all good, man. Thank you for the 20 fucking gifted. Thank you for the sub. Thank you for the fucking 20 gifted subs. You're pulling my hair. You're pulling my hair. You're pulling my hair. You're pulling my hair. Are you doing the bunny rabbit thing like you're five? All right, everybody say, get up, Brooke. Stand up, Brooke's please. Been up, Brooke's please. been up since 5 a.m. Joe's been up since 1 o'clock this no, afternoon. No, I got up at 11.30. I'll get her to stop, chat.
something. Come on. I, I got a game to play. Chair. I got a game to play. Love you. Love you. Uh, I knew I knew the penis music would get her to stand up. I think we're ready. Uh, do we want to tune into the other streamers, see what's popping? I don't and even I'm know if other people are streaming right now. Sneak Snacks playing Call of the Lamb. I think the funniest part about that is I could have killed. There is an old person. That... Nolan yeah, is just chatting. Uh, where's Zeusy? Zeusy ain't even on stream yet. Oh, brother. Change title? Oh shit, yeah, you're right. 